Hey, this is Andrew Brown from Exam Pro, and we are looking at AWS Quick Starts, which are pre-built templates by AWS Solution Architects uh, and AWS Partners to help you deploy popular stacks on AWS. And so the uh, benefit here is that it can reduce hundreds of manual uh, procedures into just a few steps, okay? So Quick Start is composed of three parts. So you're gonna get a reference architecture for the deployment. So it's gonna be like an architectural diagram and descriptions. And then the actual uh, Quick Start itself is just a CloudFormation template. And CloudFormation templates are used for provisioning multiple AWS resources. So it's gonna automate and configure that deployment for you. Uh, and it will have also a deployment guide explaining the architecture and implementation in detail, okay? So most Quick Starts are reference uh, reference deploy deployments enable you to spin up a fully functional architecture in less than an hour okay so you can get operational pretty quick with these things and on the right hand side there you can see that I've uh, cherry picked one out there from Anika and that's one uh, is for setting up an IOT camera connector okay so here I just want to give you a quick tour of AWS Quick Starts just so you have an idea of uh, what there is available to you here. And so on the left-hand side, we have a bunch of filtration options to choose um, uh, or to narrow down uh, some uh, nice templates here for us. And on the right-hand side, we already have some templates. So let's go into analytics here. And right away, we have uh, one here by Cambridge Technology, which um, automatically deploys a clickstream analytics environment for you. So that sounds pretty cool. So if we just click into uh, this actual uh, quick start here, uh, what we're going to see down below is that architectural diagram I was talking about, how, uh, or like a bunch of descriptions as to what it is doing. Uh, this stuff varies based on um, uh, uh, quick start templates, so don't expect to see the same stuff everywhere, but they'll generally give you instructions on how to deploy and then the costs or licenses involved. And so if we wanted to launch this, we go um, view deployment guide details maybe here. Okay. And, uh, oh, we got a big white paper. So uh, this one's a bit different here. Sometimes the buttons are a little bit more clear. Um, oh yeah, here it is. So again, this will vary based on each one. So I've never done this one before, but we'll say deploy into a new VPC, okay? And what that's gonna do is um, set up that CloudFormation template for you. So that's what I'm expecting anyway. So yep, there it is. It's going into CloudFormation, okay? Uh, and we're not going to go through this whole process. I'm just showing you um, at least to this stage, okay? And so here we have that template. We go next. And I'm just going to see if it asks us to provide some information. So yeah, these a CloudFormation template has a bunch of variables that you'd fill in. So based on the quick start template you have, it's just going to have different options here. As you can see, this one has a variety of options. But we would just fill that in, uh, go next, review, and launch. And then it would spin up. Um, that click stream for us. So there you go. That is um, uh, quick starts.